Our style of furniture is William and Mary. The William and Mary style, also known as the early bark and museum circles, dates from about 1695 through the mid-1720s. It is named for the king and queen, originally from Holland, who reigned together over England, Scotland, and Ireland from 1689 to 1694. The William and Mary style comes from when William III came to the English throne. Refugees from France followed him to England and began making furniture influenced by him. He liked the French style. The style focuses more on vertical lines and is very decorative. It also has, it is also lighter and more comfortable. The main features is they had lots of dovetailing technique within these pieces of furniture. The main legs used was Flemish scroll, spiral, trumpet, and columnar legs, which are all very curved. And then for feet, they had ball, bun, hoof, and turnips, which are all very round. The main materials that they used were wood from the area, such as maple, oak, and walnut. But for more exotic and luxurious fixtures, they use olive and acacia. This is an example of a William and Mary chair. It has curved trumpet legs and a decorative splat. The style is also known for high boys. This one is made from walnut wood and it uses the dovetailing technique and it also has trumpet legs. This sofa has a floral pattern. It focuses more on vertical lines and it also has a nail head trim with carved wood. Gate leg tables were also very popular for this style. They have a hinge section that's supported by pivoted legs, and there are stretchers that join the top and bottom. In conclusion, the William and Mary style originated in England. Most of the furniture fixtures are made out of wood, and they are considered a luxury furniture item. The main technique used was dovetail. They have mainly curved legs and round feet, and the style is considered decorative and tall.